Hi, I'm Gary M0TIG here at Martin Lynch & Sons. Today we're going to be looking at the Anan 8000 DLE. This is a new product from Apache Labs and it's 200 watt SDR transceiver. Really, really fantastic product. So let's get stuck in, just have a quick look. Okay, this is the rear of the Anan 8000. Um, you have the standard antenna ports. You have an array of, of, uh, of phonos here, which uh, give you things like uh, PTT, line in, and there's a digital um, line in as well. You've got ethernet port. You've got an array of 3.5 jacks there, which is a key and a microphone port. Left speaker, uh, right speaker. Um, you've also got an accessory uh, a port there as well and um, the other thing to note is it, it uses an Anderton uh, power pole connector there it's wired slightly different than than some other brands so don't use the same cable as it will end up in a in a tragedy well let's have a look at the front okay so this is the front of the Anna 8000 and as you can see from the from the front here you've got a giant red button there which is the power on and power off um, you've got a reset button standby button headphone jack mic jack and CW key and you've got a large largest screen there which gives you the SWR the temperature of the actual unit internally and tells you which which mode it's actually in and at the moment it's sitting in, in receive now inside this is actually a very very large heat sink uh, with a very large PA on the top which is 200 watts um, it's actually a 50 volt PA um, and as I say, it's got some really, really good performance characteristics, which are all in the bump. So uh, go along and have a, have a quick read of that. This is an exceptional uh, bit of kit. Um, it's, it's really substantial. It weighs an absolute ton. It's built like a tank. Um, it's got some big, strong handles on the front so that you can uh, move it around as easy as you can. And as I say, it's, it's a stainless steel uh, chassis. Um, and, and case. Okay, so let's have a quick look at the software. Um, we'll just have a, a quick run through of, uh, of how to uh, how, how it works. Okay, let's have a, a quick look at the, the, the software. Um, the software itself is fairly easy to install. Um, you need to just to pop along to Apache Labs and download the, the software. Um, I actually got this from the the the, the developers website it was a later version so have a look at both you know keep an eye on the apache labs and just uh, check the developers uh, website as well just to make sure that you've got the latest version this the the the, the really good thing about the anan range of products is that they're all open source it's open source hardware it's it's open source software so things are very dynamic they're, they're changing constantly um, there is a, a, a unique uh, connectivity there, where they're sort of modular um, parts which you can change and, and upgrade as you go along. Um, and the software is no different. In fact, I think there's about three or four different packages. Um, but at the time we're doing this, some support the 8000 and, and some don't. But I, I understand there are some, some new products that are just coming along now, uh, software um, products that will will cover the the 8000 and to be honest I, some of them are, are, are better than others and and I prefer one or two of the the other ones I think there is I think it is SDR console um, which is just about to be launched which which also supports the uh, 8000 but this is power SDR this is the one that you can get from Apache Labs and um, with this one you need to set up the audio um, so that you can obviously hear the thing. So you, you need to enable the VAC1 and you need to enable VAC2 if you're going to use it. Um, that way you'll, it'll be working you know, pretty much out of the box. Um, the volume is controlled uh, by these little sliders on the side here. You'll need to set the, the gain on the AGC gain there. Um, and you can zoom in and out of the display with this little slider down the bottom. I mean, they're the, the basic sort of functions. Um, what else can we have a quick look at? 
you tune the, the, the radio at the top here just with this, just with a mouse wheel. Um, you can, if you want to, uh, you, can, you can just uh, go to this little side over here um, and select the band that you, that you want. Um, and I believe you can also, well, that you can set it up so you can click on the, on the waterfall and it will, will jump around and, uh, and go where you need. So like sort of click and pounce uh, set up. You've also got recording. Up the, up the top here you've got things like you've got your filter width and um, there's some presets along the side here for CW etc etc um, and there's some preset zooms as well that you can you can select uh, it's got a CW sort of section and um, but the best thing of all about this is there's two things that I find absolutely fascinating one of them is the noise reduction it has two levels of noise reduction and it's also I think got two or three uh, levels of uh, noise blanker um, they they do different different things but it's just incredible how that that noise reduction works and we were we were quite gobsmacked just how good that was um, the other thing which is quite interesting is this, this diversity function you can actually select the phasing of the antennas through this little radar um, you can set it for whichever receiver you want um, in fact we've got this combined and at the moment it's disabled but you can set the the phasing and the gain of the antennas with this let's say with this little radar it's, it's a fantastic product um, you can find more details of this uh, obviously on Apache Labs website or you can find it at www.hamradio.co.uk um, where there's lots and lots of details and a download of the brochure um, of this particular radio. Okay, well, hopefully that made some sense and uh, it's been a bit of a rush here today, I, I, I will admit. So it's been very busy in the shop. Um, but that was a very quick overview of the NN8000 DLE and the Power SDR software. If you need any information, uh, do pop along to our website, hamradio.co.uk, or you can give me a call at the store, um, or you can email me directly, gary at hamradio.co.uk. Um, I'm available to answer uh, questions as I can. If, if I don't know, I, you know, I can always ask the, the, the factory. They, they'll, they're very helpful. Um, there's lots of the, the developers that you can get to speak to. Really, really good uh, uh, ethos. Um, by all means, subscribe to our channel. Um, there's lots and lots of videos that, that come up for you know, how-tos and uh, obviously in, uh, product information. Um, and of course, all of our used kit. So thanks for watching. I'm Gary, M0TIG. Thanks for watching.